Is that pulling from exhaust? I have no idea. I just saw him stop, y'all. Oh. <laughs> I was like, it's been like that. It's been like, did you buy it like that? Yeah. Okay. I bought it like that. Like, I haven't done anything. If people ask me what's in it, I don't even know what to say what's in it. I'm just right. like, I bought it like that. <laughs> How long you had it? Uh, like a year. Okay. But it, it, the guy does some aftermarket stuff to us. Right. Is that an SS? Yeah. Almost four dollars a gallon. It probably sucks to drive. Yeah, that's. Yeah, I put like twenty-five dollars in it uh, a couple hours ago, and it was. Hang on, stand by. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Get on the ground. Stop. I'm gonna chase you. One, two, three, four. Radio, change deployed. Hey. Stay where you're at. I'm gonna chase you again. Put your arms out. One seven forty. Stop another unit now. Put your arms out. Stop tensing up. You're gonna get it again. One. I'm gonna tase you again. Loosen up. Watch. Her. Loosen up. We're Pleasant Hill westbound at Buford Highway. Stop tensing up, bro. I will tase you again. Stop. We've got a female back by our vehicles. If you can go with her, stop please. Up. You're gonna get tased again. Dude, stop! I will tase you again. Relax. Okay, pop. You're good. Good pop. Negative. We're not sitting. Good. It's a good mission. Negative. We've got one in custody. Taser deployed. I've got a loose canine and one subject in front of my vehicle. One seven forty. Go ahead. Start FD, please. Taste. You got taste because you decided to run so much, right? Oh, my God. Let's go. Oh, yeah, careful of the wires, guys. Oh, yeah, go ahead. I got that cartridge in there. I've got FD in route form. Oh yeah, FD in route. Yes, sir. Uh, can you get your? We'll get your kit. We'll take the pictures real quick. What did I do? Yeah. It's not my taser. It's mine. Yeah, it's I'm the one. I, I deployed. Well, then I don't know what y'all. We gotta, get, we gotta get pictures as well. Okay. Uh, you got one? You wanna go grab your camera so I start taking uh, pictures and all? We've got. Hey, Bray. Yeah. Do you have a city issue? Yeah. What? Do you have a city issue phone? Yeah. I'll stand by with her. Can you take pictures of the uh, deployment for me? Okay. Cool. Thank you. Appreciate it. Earl, can you stay with her? Yeah, do. Did you lose a turn again? Yeah, no, sir. Couldn't ask for a better spread. Cool. Appreciate it. Yeah, no, it wouldn't mean. Did you lose a turn again, sir? It's yours? Okay. Let me grab my flash out real quick.
that shit hurt. He's got a little bit of rash. He landed face first on the grass. On, on lock up. Why are you guys doing this? Because you ran. Huh? We're good. Right, come on, come on here, bro. Stop it. Stop. Yeah. Appreciate it. Oh, good. Gonna get. <laughs> Where's the dog? Huh? Where's the dog? I think they were secured one of the cars. Yeah, we put it in one. Cool. Was it his dog? Yeah, it was his dog. It was uh, just a um, Roddy. Super friendly. Good thing. Yeah. Well, I had the second car to John Standby. Oh. Hey, Greg, give us a light. Oh. So, I think we're good. All right, we got enough counting. Thank you, Austin. Appreciate it. Yeah, Come on, man. Oh. Have a seat. What is this in there? Have a seat. What is that? Dude, you're going in one way or the other. Suggest it's under your own power. I'm going to see it. Oh. That's a good job. Good. Uh, where's that cartridge at? I gotta, once we get that out, I got to wrap that back up, put it evidence. What did I do, man? Why don't you do this? We responded to your actions, partner. Huh? Get all the way in. I'm saying, did I do something? Yeah, you did something. Get all the way in. All the way in. We're good. Okay. We'll see uh, yeah, it's mine. <laughs> oh, okay. I'll tell you something. I gotta do use of force and everything else. Alright, I'll start my chat. Yeah, I know. I'm gonna let FD remove those. And then I'll package it up, I'll get their case number and do the uh, chain of custody and all that. Alright, I'll start doing my chain notification. Appreciate it. So, so he went he went to have the guy step out of the car, obviously started marijuana, guy refused to step out of the vehicle. Um, so he started to pull him out, the guy started physically resisting, attempted to run. He was still hands-on. As soon as he pushed him away to break free, taser dropped. Hey, I mean, at a, you have misdemeanor obstruction at, at a minimum. So, uh, in one of their vehicles. Yeah. Super, super friendly Rottweiler. I showed up. I saw him running around. I don't know what's going on. So, um, not sure. Either of you guys got a rapper that's charged? Not one that yeah, works. Yeah, I don't think. Uh, I appreciate it. Yeah, dude. No, I worse. knew he was, as soon as he, he was like... Oh, the, when you first made contact with him? Yeah. Well, no, when I first made contact with him, he was super nervous. But also, when I went back up to him, because uh, she's like, hey, isn't that Justin? Yeah. He's like, he told me Seth, Sam right oh, there. Oh, and, uh, that's so easy enough. Up. Like, hey, man, so I'm going to have you step out real quick. He's okay. like, okay. He's trying to grab his dog. He's like, no, yeah. my dog's coming out. I'm like, leave the fucking dog alone. Yeah. Let's get the hell out of here. Yeah, I got you. I thought that was your dog over there. No. Nah. No. You see, like a little rot wire nah. around. Like, what the hell? <laughs> no, nah, I had to retire mine. Oh, you did? Yeah, I got swapped back over to uh, patrol. Okay. So, so just like uniforms, I'm back on the road. What's up for you? We're code 4. Yeah. It's 10 12 for FD. Does he serve us or did he get hurt or something? Just, uh, the department's going a different route with it. Okay. So, right. uh, they. I work for the will of the chief. I do what they say. I, I'm happy to do it. you got to explain it to me, man. So, I doesn't mean it's okay to do my job. Did he just take off? Yeah. He was physically resisting um, with him. He still had hands on. And, he was in the uh, passenger seat? Yeah. I didn't, have a, I didn't have a clear shot when he was moving from the car. Once he broke away. Yeah, we, had a, we did something at Walton one time when he was coming out uh, in tour. Yeah. In Walton. And he ended up... Uh, that's a fight with one of your officers. That happened like within 100 yards yeah. of the county line. Yeah, so... 
uh, one of their detectives, the, this female that used to work for us, yeah. she was helping us out, and the passenger hopped in the driver's seat and took right. off. And they're like, yeah, we got him ID, but we don't know if we charge him. Like, why? She's like, well, you can't detain passengers on traffic stops. Yeah, well, that was our reaction. And we're, she goes, no, what? it's case law. You need to update your case law. And I'm like, no, you absolutely can. 100% case, case yeah. the opposite of case law. Yeah. And she's like, started getting snippy with me. I'm like, what? <laughs> Oh, oh that could go. have gone sideways quick. I agree, but yeah. sideways one way. Yeah. Yeah. All the way down. Can you Mirandize her? What? You just Mirandize her? Sir. Uh, he's got face rash from where he hit the grass. Uh, face rash from face hitting the grass. I do go. I do try to get it booted up. Yeah, it feels good. Yeah. Maybe. Mine, mine doesn't like the, mine's the power cycle. So, alright. Uh, yeah, I'll let you know they're trying to get, trying to get the right side. So. Covered, it's got a 9 millimeter. Hmm. He's, he's a convicted felon. Yeah. One seven forty. We're code four. You can hold checks. I guess it's good you got him for. He got you, brother. What's that? So I guess it's good you got him for. He got you. Yeah, he, was, he was running that way. The gun was in the car. In the car. Yeah. Uh, meth. Yeah. Meth. More weed. Ball. Well, you can tell by the way he's damn acting when he goes. That's to a lot of meth. He said, "Who else is back here?" That's a lot of meth. That's, that's a good bit, meth. Yeah, that's why. I What's your birthday? No, I, I just got taped. Yes. You said Jason's your birthday? Justin. Justin. What's your birthday? My car's open, computer's up and running. Alright. Alright, take a second. Move your seat back. Mine's right there if you need to. Oh, shoot. Okay. I don't, I'm good. This is all just wire. Uh, hey, 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 easy. Yeah. One probe came out, so one probe's still there. Oh, Hang on. It's hanging in his pants. Okay, let me go ahead and do this real quick. Still in him? Oh. Yeah. I take one to the back, like one to the bottom. Oh, dude, you couldn't have asked for a better spread of that. Mm -hmm. uh, it's a taze, a moving target like that. So, turn around. One here, one here. Ooh. Immediate lockup. Yeah, you can about, you, I mean, that's textbook, like the, what they teach you. So. Does anybody have like a small evidence bag or anything? I got gloves, I can wrap it up on gloves. Would you mind? Yeah. Cool. Well, let me get that other probe first. Yeah, and then used I'll, to. I'll okay. just hang on to them and use them and then just okay. flip it inside out. Yeah. Once they remove that last probe, I'll tuck that in there, wrap everything up, and then uh, take it to the PD. I had no idea what the heck you were saying on the radio at first. I didn't even know if I was going out. You were going was, out. It's the, like the first, your first traffic, I was like, I had no idea who that even was. Second lady on foot. I was just right there. Uh, and, then, and then I heard the 80 part after that. And so I was like, are you on the car or are you on foot? I was on foot. <laughs> and you're like, never mind. He's safe. I'm like, okay. Yeah. I stop. Yeah. Over here. Right place, right time. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, for sure. <laughs> Seth, what's up, man? Oh, yeah, right. He's in the back of here. He's still got one probe in his back. Uh, he's got a little bit of road rash from where he got tased and fell down. So, 
Okay. Are you guys able to just pull the probe out so I can collect it? Cool. Are you you should also fancy new little bailing? No. Nah. Little wrap thing? No, just nah. the... straight taser. I don't think we have a bowl on it. Somebody use one of those. That's what I'm. <laughs> you got to go to y'all's little dip. Yeah, I'm there for Okay. Yeah. I think we're good, man. If I need something, I'll holler at you. I'll start sending my text messages. Yeah. Because I told Barry, I was like, I'll send you a case number. Right now. Are you going to do the report on our case number? Yes. Okay. Yep. And I'll get a copy of their number and put that in there as well. Um, that way they can associate the taser deployment with their, their okay. case. Yeah, I'll send it. Uh, 17 or 18. Because uh, it's their charges. I'll do 17. Okay. We don't. I'll tell you what, I'll, when it comes time to write the report, I'll get with you on it and uh, we can figure it out. Sorry, but I've got to cut your jack a little bit. Oh, my bad. I got him center of the back. I got him center of the back. Ouch! Did you put the belt liner on? Oh, yeah. Um, right in the center of the back, and then we're right back here. Oh, it could be worse. We could use those cold weather ones for like that long. Oh, dude. Well, I knew with that jacket on and as loose as it was, I was never going to get a good deployment. And whenever he stripped the jacket off, I was like, there we go. Oh, y'all have the sevens. Yeah. Oh, no, no, no. We got the X2s. X2s, yeah. Uh, I don't have the sevens. I saw the. Oh, is that. Oh, I, yeah, I saw this thing and I thought that was the card. Yeah, no, yeah, yeah, no, the X2. Oh, yeah. Switch out. Have you Not bad. Living the dream. Oh yeah, 7 p.m. to 7 a.m. Okay. Our, our K9 is not. Okay. Our K9 is fucking. Okay. They got training tomorrow, so. I'm oh, that's in. right. Uh, no, my, they retired my dog, so uh, I'm going back to the road. Uh, yep. Do y'all have a, a dog working right now? Nope. Nope. So unless the SO's got one. <laughs> yeah, Lawrence Miller SO. That's right. Hart's working tonight, isn't he? How the hell do they normally get these things out? Just, just really just ripping. Like, so you, cool. the way they taught us is you just put your palm on it like in an L, right here. like around it, and then you just straight okay, cool. out. Yep. So you, yeah. <laughs> I'm surprised you're still in them. Chat me your case number when you get it, I'll upload this picture. Okay, yeah man. You have to grip the hell out of it and give it a good yank. No buddy, I'm good. It's very notified chain, everybody around the house, if possible. Just, I didn't know if there was anybody else inside the car. Yeah, it happens. I'm out. I'm like, oh, okay, here we go. You good? No. Yeah. You a Hudgens or? Right, Jay Smart. Appreciate it, man. Let her go out over. All right, here we go. Let her go out over there, radio, before I heard it on the radio. There we go. Worst part's over. All right, what's up? You good now? Oh, yeah, it sucks. Yeah. I had no clue. Oh, yeah, they suck. Hey, those things are mean. Yes, they are. They work great. There's one, there's one already in one of these bays. I caught one in the ass cheek when they tased me. Yeah. That's. Yeah, this is not. Deeper than I thought it was. Yeah. yeah so that's what I was saying. Rip it and. They're, they're not built for fun, that's for sure. Yeah. I thought it like kind of like just hooked it. Oh, these these are worse I'll, than I'll the. I'm trying to like pull it like a hook. Yeah. No, these are worse than the freaking uh, the 27s we used to carry. Or the 26s. Is that straight up a uh, uh, taser? Taser car? Yeah. yeah. Yep. Sevens are going to be meaner. Yeah. yeah. More cycle, more cycles per second. Hit you a little bit harder. Yeah. They're they're gnarly, man. Yeah. That looks like a lot of fun. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I don't ever. I'll tell you what, I'd rather get tased before I ever got pepper sprayed again, though. 100%. Oh, yeah, 100%. Uh, 100%. Nope, I'm on. Well, I use a CI for someone. I think it was County. That sucks. Yeah, oh, yeah, that's what it's doing. I've never seen anything with that thing. I got a torch. Anybody want it? Find out. Who did run? Who stopped? Did you stop him? No, he stopped him. You stopped him? No. Did that run? Did he run from you? I was gonna, I was gonna go to quick trip. You run? No, the vehicle didn't. No, because uh, no. it's funny because every time I stop her, her passengers go to jail. This is the third time that I've stopped her and taken somebody to oh jail. Oh my gosh, hey, Abby. Huh? What's her name Abby. No, I don't think so. I feel so smart. 
but I have the car plugged into our car, and every time it, it's in there, I'm like, I'm gonna stop you because your passenger's probably gonna go to jail. <laughs> every time. Every time. She, no, she's okay. always clean. She's yeah. fine. She lets me search your car and everything. It's a passenger. Is it an Uber? Is that? No. She's just. She used to. She used to traffic meth, so she, her, she keeps her circle small, apparently. Okay, just enough. Uh, yeah. Heck yeah. So. He told you it was 10 out of barrel for Larceny? Yeah. Okay. Oh, I've seen you a lot lately, man. Uh, <laughs> this stuff is actually for something legit. Yeah, right? <laughs> That's bullshit around. For weddings or... Yeah. Oh, man. You working uh, Thanksgiving this year? Oh, no, I'm off Thursday Thursday and Friday That's this awesome. Year, but I'm working Christmas Eve. Yeah. That's right. Yeah, I'm working all Christmas weekend, so... Yeah. Let me get out of here. Safe, All right, good to see you, man. See you, man. Y'all be safe, man. Take care, man. Good job. That's my case now, real quick. My name, badge number, case number for the deployment. Okay, awesome. So, man. I appreciate it. Yeah. If I can get your case number so I can reference it in ours, I don't have a problem with it. Yeah, one, dude, I'm not going anywhere anytime soon. Okay. Yeah, just. Yeah, I got you. Go ahead. Headlights are kind of. Yeah, they do get a little warm. It feels good and it gets real hot. Come, come January, it's not too bad to stand against them, but right now it's not, it's not the greatest thing in the world. So I was, I was right behind. No, you're no, you're perfectly fine. Um, the way you did it, it probably would have been a little bit better for you to pull off on that side street right there. Oh, just got okay. a traffic, but here's fine too. It just this is a little bit more risk for y'all, for him, especially for uh, Justin. Yeah, if he got squished by a car taking off running, that's gonna uh, suck. You know. Um, thankfully, everything worked out for everybody. I the light turned red. I yeah. Sitting there, no, like, yeah, I you can do it. No, we're, we're not going to do that. If anything, we'll, you'll be able to hear us tell you to pull to a safer location because we're not going to put you at risk either. You know, anytime we stop a vehicle on the side of the road, something like that, we're responsible for the safety of everyone involved. So.
that's not a pressure unit. I don't yeah. care. Okay. I literally don't care. I just don't care. Or something. Yeah. I appreciate you staying put instead of jumping in the car and doing something silly. Yeah. I'm a little too old for all this nonsense. Just as much crap in Savannah as you can here. Regardless of where you're at, it's you go into freaking million dollar neighborhood houses and you'll find it just as easily. Uh, anywhere. Uh, yeah. Doesn't matter where. You said there's a leash for the dog in the back of the car. Yeah. Is it? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna release it in just a second here. Yeah. Give me your citation, and then the dog is gonna be taken, and then I'll get to it. Is it gonna cost me money to make my car not so loud? I'm sorry, ma'am. Is it cost money to make my car not so loud? You have to have some work done to it. Really? Yes, ma'am. I mean, I'll let you know if somebody knows how to do it. I bought it like that, so I didn't know anything. So he just told me said that yeah. they said that. Yeah. Yeah, it's, yeah, and anytime you do work to a car, it, it costs money. Now, if you get it fixed before your court date, is he giving you a ticket for it? Okay. If, if he if he winds up giving you an actual ticket for it, 
and you bring the receipts to the court to show them that you've gotten it taken care of, they'll work with you on it. <laughs> and that, that's the way they look at it. Is, you know, if you spend, you know, if the ticket's only 150 bucks and you spend $300 getting it fixed, and you show up, hey, look, I've, I've taken care of the problem, they're going to work with you on it. But I'm not saying they'll make it go away, but no, they'll, they'll I mean, work I with you. I saying, though, because, like, otherwise I could get another ticket. Another yes, ma'am. So like, right. Get yes, ma'am. Uh, your court date will probably be after the first of the year, so you'll, you'll have some time. Usually it runs about 45 to 60 days out, okay. Okay, so you'll have time to take care of it and get things squared away, get the move done. Um, as long as you're going to have to bring that receipt to court with you, um, if you decide to come back for court, you can just pay the citation and not worry about it, or you can bring the receipt back to court and say, hey, look, I've taken care of it. Here's the paperwork okay. shown. Uh, that would be up to them. I don't know, how, I don't know if they've got a county okay. ordinance versus the... So the, the way the law is written, as I believe it's um, audible noise coming from a vehicle within 100 feet, the way the county ordinance is written is within 50, so it's a little bit more restrictive. Uh, so all, all those little, yeah, all those little freaking coffee can cars and everything else. Uh, sound ordinance, it's not just exhaust, it's, it can also apply to any of your speakers, subwoofers, and things like yeah, that. I thought, I thought that's pretty much the sound yeah, ordinance. Yeah. No, so there's the there's also a, um, a state law for uh, aftermarket exhaust and how loud it can be, certain decibel levels, and things like that. So. Yeah, it, I, yeah. I didn't know what kind of <laughs> that literally that car it may be nothing more than the mufflers they put on it glass packs or something like that um, so it may just be a simple um, exhaust swap so but without actually getting up underneath it and looking at it I couldn't tell you exactly what it is on the mufflers no no you'd actually have to swap out the entire muffler because the, mu the muffler is built to uh, resonate at a different frequency. It also allows more um, air pressure to push out. A lot of the uh, aftermarket exhaust will actually increase the performance out of the motor. You're only talking probably 15 horsepower at most out of a lot of them. Um, unless you go for a very serious upgrade in your exhaust, then you're probably talking 25, 30 horsepower just from the exhaust, just because of the, the compression rate that it allows the fuel to burn out. Catalytic converter right? Yes. Correct. Yeah, your catalytic converter. Um, Mine on it. I'm sorry? Do I have one? Oh, yeah, you definitely have a catalytic converter on it. If you didn't, you'd hear it. it. It'd be a lot louder than that. Oh, really? Yeah. Um, you'd also know a, a drastic change in your engine performance. Um, you cannot run a vehicle very long without a catalytic converter. Because uh, that would convert it. Because uh, that, that controls the amount of airflow from the engine through the exhaust. If they straight pipe it, you're fine. Okay, that must have been what they did. Yes. Because, I know that I because you still have to have a pipe coming oh, through there. Correct. Yeah. yeah, if you straight pipe it, you're fine because you can have that direct line going through. But if you cut that catalytic converter, there's no longer oh, a back okay. pressure. Okay. Yeah. Correct. got lucky because they just retired my dog last week. If I'd been here tonight with my dog, he'd gotten dog bit. Uh, and my dog my dog was not a dog you'd want to get bit by. Those are Malinois. Just ma'am. He's a well he's a well behaved pup but Bite sucks. Where, where is he at right now? He's at home. He's retired. Oh, oh, okay. Yep. How long did he work? About four years. You, you can get about, you know, sometimes you can get about six, um, but he started developing some uh, some hip issues and they had to retire medically. So 
He's only about six years old, so. Don't they have those a lot like, where it's cold? Not usually. A lot of it, um, your biggest determination is the bloodlines in the dog. Um, the purer the bloodlines, the fewer the issues, but that's not always the case. Every once in a while, you'll come across one that could be the greatest dog in the world, and you never catch it until it hits them. So that's just the cost of the dog. It, ha it happens. Uh, he had a good career. I was happy to work him. He just retired? Just like last week, you think? Yep. Yep. Yep, he's sleeping by fire right now. Do you need a four back or not for him? Oh, okay. It's supposed to get down about 36 tonight. Yeah, it's supposed to warm back up for the next week or so into the mid 40s at night. Fluffy guy like me, I like the gold. I work better in it. Yeah, I'd be wearing shorts right now. It's man. She said she's got a leash in the back seat used yeah, for the dog. Yeah, yeah. 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 We'll probably let you get the dog out. Yeah. Hey, did you see him swallow any? Come here. Did you see him swallow anything? Huh? Get some swallow. Guess me that much? Yeah, man. What's up? C case of incarceritis? Huh? Incarceritis? Yeah, he's saying that he swallowed half a gram of fentanyl. Quite He'd be dead by now. That's what I'm saying. Half Before. a gram? Oh, yeah. That's what I'm saying. His vitals are probably fine. But. Uh, yeah, you gotta follow your protocol and policy. I get it. We're the same way. And she just confirmed that she didn't see him swallow anything when they were being stopped because he said that while they were being stopped, he did it. Thank you. Got it. I got a dog coming behind you. It's friendly, but just to let you know. 
No, I got Narcan in the car, but yeah, I got some too. I didn't need it <laughs> no. because he was breathing fine. And oh, was fighting fine. just fine. And he says, then out of nowhere, he's like, I swallow fentanyl, and wants to be like, oh, I'm gonna pass out. I've always found if you if you thump them in the eyeball, they respond. They're good. Somebody like to pass out. What uh, did the white powder test for anything? Yeah, it's all bad. Just hit him with uh, We thought it was, if it had some charge to it, it would have yeah. some good weight, but it was uh, 16 grams. 16 grams of meth, and then uh, a bunch of marijuana. What's this guy saying? Are you going to take me on? We're going to take me on. I'm going to come over to this guy's phone. All right, well, they're going to defer it. Can you just check the white Thankful I didn't tase you. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I was, like I said, I, I was getting ready to throw him down. He yeah. shook that jacket. Yeah. I'm like, motherfucker. Oh, oh, no, that was perfect. Yeah. With that jacket, never would have gotten no, a connection. No, absolutely not. So I saw that jacket come off. Yeah. <laughs> I got all giddy. Oh, that was good. I appreciate it. I'm here for you guys, man. So I was on my way to Quick Trip. Yeah, His info. His info. He just needs a name, name, birth, address. We should have an extra job officer over there. Yeah. So, cool. yeah. There's one over there next to the okay. That's the closest place, and they're the fastest. They're also so quick and slow. They, yeah. they, 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 like, they want to get guys and people out. Oh, yeah. Also, they want you to stay there for as long as they can find. Four to six hours, yeah. minimum. They're, they're like, we need you out here. Yep. Yeah, that's, that's all I want to do. Sometimes the opposite direction is hard to backtrack all the way through all this traffic. Cool. cool. All right. All right, gentlemen. Yeah. Appreciate it, man. Seth, always good to see you, buddy. You too, bro. Appreciate it. Yeah, my Give pleasure. Help. Yeah. Yeah, we, we were we were on our way. <laughs> he, he said he was going to get the car, and he's familiar with the vehicle. Yeah. Because he got something out of it the last time. <laughs> and, uh, so we were, he was familiar with it, so we were just trying to get caught up. Yeah. And uh, I, 
Next thing you know, it's like you got to stop going, but we're way back toward 85. Oh, yeah. Pleasant <laughs> we're all in the same unit. And the next thing you know, like, it's like, <laughs> let's go. Hey, happy to help y'all out, man. Y'all be safe.